This is affordable RFID module with DTL serial output and assistation.com sent me one in exchange for making a little test video about it. You can find the pinouts from the product page or by following along with this video. Here's the actual module after a little bit of soldering. First I soldered the coil directly to the module and I soldered 5 pin pin header for connections between this module and microcontroller which in this case is Arduino compatible device. I printed out the pinouts just for my own reference. You can find this same image and table on the IC stations website. In my case PCC this 3.3 volts. This module works between 3 and 5 volts so no problems there. Then there's the serial output pin. I'm going to use software serial port which works just fine as this module uses quite slow 9600 port rate. The pin called LED connector is open collector output which gives an output pulse when the module detects an RFID tag which can be used to give a visual feedback for the user that the tag has been detected. Next I'll do those connections between my 3.3 volt Arduino and the RFID module. The first pin is ground which goes to ground. Then the VCC which like said can be anything between 3 and 5 volts. I'm not sure if it affects any reading distances or anything like that but it works with 3.3 volts without any problems. Next pin is the serial output pin. I've chosen one GPIO pin on my Arduino and I'm using software serial port. So I can use the hardware serial port to communicate with the PC. The next pin is the LED output. I have connected a node of the LED to the VCC and from cathode of the LED resistor to this pin. So when this pin pulls the voltage down, the LED will lit up. And now all the required connections have been made, so I can show you this in action. First the LED output. The LED will light up when I move an RFID tag close to the coil. That alone isn't really useful as it can't detect different RFID tags. It just shows that there is an RFID tag, not a specific one. But using the OLED display from one of my previous videos, I can show that the Arduino gets an ID from the tag, as you can see on the small text above the key 1 or key 2 text. Once you get the Arduino to detect different RFID tags, it's up to you to decide what to do with the information. For example, you can open an electric lock when certain RFID tag has been detected, or just about anything else that you can come up with. For coding tips, check the description. Remember to like this video, subscribe, and maybe leave a comment or share this video.